hi welcome to automation testing dot in in this video we are going to discuss about a very important topic why web driver driver is called new firefox driver this is one important line when you're working with selenium web driver this is a first line when you write a program but why will write a web driver driver is called new firefox driver usually it will create an object to a class like class a obj equal new class a. here class a is in a class if you want to create an object to that the syntax will be like this means this and this is same but here we will write a web driver driver is called new firefox driver this is not equal to this this is web driver and this is firefox driver but why we will write like this now we will see the architecture of selenium web driver then we will discuss the line See, this is WebDriver architecture. A WebDriver is an interface in Selenium WebDriver. Along with that, we have one more important interface called JavaScript Executor. These are the both important interfaces in Selenium. And these both were implemented by Sel Remote WebDriver. Remote WebDriver is a class. It implements WebDriver as well as JavaScript Executor. Apart from that, we have so many uh, drivers like Firefox driver, Chrome driver, IE driver, and different drivers. Each uh, driver is a class, means Firefox driver is one class, Chrome driver is one class, IE driver is one class. And all these extended from remote web driver, means Firefox driver extends remote web driver, as well as Chrome also same thing, and IE driver also same thing. This is brief uh, introduction and uh, architecture of web driver, how it works. Now we will see some of the statements how it will be so like we will see some of the lines here a web driver driver is called new web driver can we write like this means here we will discuss that class a obj equal new class a in the same way web driver driver is called new web driver no we cannot do like this okay we cannot do like this uh, uh, the same way firefox driver driver equal new firefox driver yes we can do this this is a valid line the same way chrome driver and ie driver also we can do same thing and the last is web driver driver is called new firefox driver this is what we are going to discuss why we are writing like this there are the few statements we'll see practically what will happen now we'll move to the next slide like now we'll discuss theoretically what is web driver and what is firefox driver etc a web driver is an interface an interface contains only empty methods that have been defined but not implemented these methods can be implemented by one uh, anyone as long as the method type and signature are not violated means if you implement any interface to a class it should be like the method type and signature should not be violated it should be the same therefore an interface is also known as contract because you can use an interface as you like but you cannot change the way it has been defined and since it has empty methods you won't actually need to instantiate and you cannot instantiate it means web drivers an interface in java if it is an interface you cannot instantiate you cannot create an object because if you have the web driver interface any interface will have empty methods you can see uh, two different methods for example we have a get method and get title method we have these two methods in the web driver but it doesn't have any implement both doesn't have any implement these two are empty methods if you create an object if you call this method also nothing will happen so no need to create and you cannot create this we will see practically also this is one thing means we will discuss about web driver web driver is an interface you cannot create an object to this so we will not create an object that is what we have seen here like we cannot create an object to web driver and we will see what is firefox what is chrome what is ie these are all classes and that has been written specially for the Firefox Chrome IE browser. This will have methods that are implemented and this can be instantiated. 
this Firefox driver is implementing WebDriver, so you can use those methods means get methods, get title methods, etc. Et we have so many methods like this. This will perform all the functions on Firefox, Chrome, IE respectively as defined in the interface WebDriver. How you define in the WebDriver? Same way you will use these methods in a class and you will have the implementation according to your need. See this is implementation and the get title also will have their own implementation depends upon the class. Firefox driver will have different implementation, Chrome driver will have different implementation, IE driver will have different implementation. Depends of the uh, need means the method name will be same, signature will be same, everything is different uh, same but the implementation the way you implement is different according to their need. So this is a brief introduction about what is an interface, uh, why, web driver, uh, why we cannot create an object to web driver and Firefox, Chrome, IEL these are all classes you can create an object to this the reason is these methods are implemented you can create an object if you call this the implementation will execute okay now we will see like so in the above statement we are actually telling Firefox driver, Chrome driver, IV driver class that you can automate the various methods that you want on the Firefox, Chrome, IE respectively. But you need to stick to the contract defined in the web driver. So we declare a reference variable of the web driver and then use it to instantiate Firefox, Chrome, IE driver which means that the object, the driver object is of type web driver but it points to the memory allocation to the all data methods of Firefox, Chrome, IE. So when you create an object, it will refer to the Firefox, Chrome, IE respectively. And as mentioned above, Firefox, Chrome, IE driver class already has the implemented version of the web driver. So when you create an object to, means reference to web driver, it will point to the class of Firefox, Chrome, IE respectively which you use. Now, we'll take an example like we have a parent test Firefox driver driver we have a child test how you call this in the child test we will see practically like uh, in Eclipse when you this extends parent test okay now we'll see like driver is called a new Firefox driver this is object you are creating the object of same class means class names are same you can create like this See, this is a valid statement you can create like this and driver equal new chrome driver here it is Firefox I am using chrome so class are different you cannot do like this because these both are class and they are on same level means uh, one class is not extending another class. Now Chrome driver driver is called new Chrome driver. Why because here you already instantiated one driver cannot create same object for the different classes. You already created an object called driver to Firefox so you cannot create the same name for another class in the same class. Okay this is also not possible. Chrome driver driver one equal to new Chrome driver. You can do like this. So this is a valid statement but in this context if you do like this the pointing to reference will be different one is different to one object and another is different uh, referring to some other object so your code will not execute okay so we will use web driver driver it's called new firefox driver because this is pay interface and if firefox driver is implementing this one we can uh, implement all the methods which are there in the web driver in the Firefox driver and this will refer to Firefox driver object so you can uh, you can call all the methods which are there in the Firefox you can execute this way you can do this one so we will use web driver driver is called new Firefox driver now we will see all these things practically in the Eclipse now we will go to Eclipse you can say like 
I'll create one class, new class. I'll say parent test. Okay. Here, I will create one object called Firefox driver driver. Simply, I'll create one object, one class, and I'll take an object. I'll implement this. Now, I'll go to uh, I'll create one more class child test for example and it extends parent test okay now here I'll create one method public void some test method now I want to create an object to Firefox driver I can create I'll save all these things see I saved it from here equal new Firefox driver now I'll import this you see this no errors means you can create an object to the same class means we are extending parent test here we uh, declare this one I can create an object to the Firefox okay this is valid statement which we have seen now I'll create object for the same thing chrome driver I import this now you see there is a an error like type mismatch cannot convert from chrome driver to firefox driver this is one class and this is another class you cannot create object like this so you cannot create if you put chrome driver here it will work but this way it will not work now I can say like this is firefox driver and I can create one more like chrome driver driver equal new chrome driver if I want to create like this it will create but this uh, it will have different methods and it will have different methods so it is referring to Firefox it is referring to Chrome if you write some code using driver dot find element driver or something it it will not execute why because which driver it has to take okay if I say driver dot get now which driver it will take so there is a confusion you cannot take like this now if I want to take on a, I can create an object like this driver one but this is different this is different if you create like this no it will not work as we discussed here some uh, same code will ex uh, not execute but different process as the object is different so we will write web driver driver equal you see like you cannot create the same object for different classes you have to create you have to create either one either this or this so you cannot create like this so the reason is uh, uh, because of that we are creating driver 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 equal new now what is the need I can create like this right Firefox driver driver equal new Firefox driver Chrome driver driver equal new Chrome driver and it will execute fine it will execute it will open the browser it will perform all the actions which you want even though why you are writing web driver driver equal to new here the scenario comes if you are automating your scripts on only Firefox driver no problem you can create Firefox driver equal uh, driver equal to new Firefox driver you can execute no problem absolutely it will, it will work you can achieve what you want in the same way if you want to execute only on Chrome driver Chrome driver driver equal new Chrome driver it will execute perfectly but there is a scenario like browser compatibility means you are 
you want to execute the same code on Firefox, Chrome, I. And if you want to implement the same thing using grid, means in one node you want to execute Firefox, in one node you want to execute Chrome. Then the object of driver is different for Chrome driver and Firefox driver if you create like this. Firefox driver driver could new Firefox driver, Chrome driver driver could new Chrome driver. The driver will refer to some other area. So the same code will not work for different browsers. If you want to execute the same code for different browsers, you have to write web driver driver equal new Chrome driver. Then you can use the same driver object for different browsers. Then you can achieve that browser compatibility. If you want to execute same code in grid, you can execute. That is the reason we will create an object of web driver driver is called new Firefox driver. This is the basic logic behind this. Okay. Thank you. That's all in this video. Don't forget to subscribe to automation testing channel and please like us at our Facebook page.